What's going on YouTube? This is Mr. Scott01 coming to you with another fragrance review. Before I get started, I would like to encourage all of you to like, share, subscribe, you know, hit that subscribe button and click the little bell below. Um, to be honest with you, you know, I'm guilty of it too. I'll find content I like and I'll just say I will wait to the next video until, instead of subscribing. But I would like to encourage you to subscribe. Now on with today's video. Today we're looking at one from the house of Rasasi, and that one is no other than Quasmat Rasana. Quasmat Rasana. This one right here, it honestly reminds me of Hasavat, not Creed of Ventus or anything like that, but Hasavat. And it's only a, a, a mild difference that separates the two to me. Um, Hasavat has more of a bright pineapple. And this one is a little bit more woody. This one does have a pineapple vibe, but we're going to get into it. Quasimat Rosano. Mm. Very nice indeed. On initial opening of this one, you get a slight medicinal smell for about a good 10 seconds, but it's not bad at all. It's very bearable. Then you get an apple, bergamot, and lemon. It gives it that pineapple-ish vibe. I wouldn't say pineapple, but a pineapple-ish vibe. It's very nice. It's an eau de parfum. So, you know, you should get your quality. Let's take a look at the sprayer. Real good sprayer. You know, and this one is honestly... 60 bucks compared to Hasselbaum and a 1.7 for like 140, 150. That's a pretty good savings. Very nice, very nice. This one has something in it called Nargamotha, and it's a mix between patchouli and cedar, and it also has some agarwood undertones. You get some musk, amber, it's a very nice fragrance with a real nice presentation too as well. You know, you have your gold dots on the front of this one, Rasana written in English as well as Arabic. You have your Arabic up top, nice tassels. They have four from this line. All of them were released in the year 2020. Uh, it's four of them from this line, and I believe all of them are reminiscent of other expensive niche fragrances. Very nice thick bottle. Heavy cap. It's more of a copper color. I don't, know, I don't know if you can see it on the camera, but it's more of a copper than a gold, but it's a very nice presentation, very classy. As I said before, I got this one in a 2.1 ounce 60 ml bottle for 60 bucks, and, and it's amazing. This one lasts on my skin nine hours plus. Yes, nine hours plus. So you're gonna get the longevity out of this one. Uh, it projects moderately for about a good six hours, and it's beastly for the first two or three hours. I would say a man or a woman can pull this one off. Um, it does lean a slightly more masculine, but it's a very nice presentation, and it's also labeled as unisex. You know, and, and of course, you know, everything that's labeled unisex always isn't unisex, but this one right here, it could be done. I would recommend this one for any age group, young, middle-aged, old, it can be worn by anyone. It's a nice spring and summer type scent. And it's very long lasting, especially for the price. You cannot beat this as a, at all. You cannot beat this at all. So if you're looking for something that's very reminiscent, not an exact clone of Hasselbott, go for it. Like I said, with Hasselbott, you get more of that bright pineapple. And with this one, you get more woods. So you get a pineapple -ish vibe with more woods with this one. Very nice indeed. And it's a bang for your buck, in my opinion. Oh, yeah. Very nice. Now that you've got my opinion on this one, let's look at the official note breakdown of Kwasamat Rasana from the House of Rasasi. At the top, we have apple, bergamot, and lemon. And in the mid, we have leather, sandalwood, in Nargamotha. And at the base, 
we have musk, cedar, amber, and agarwood. Yeah, yeah, y'all, I'm still smelling it. Um, I'd like to thank every last one of you, men and women, for taking your time out to spend with me, Mr. Scott One, and my review of Kwasamat Rasana from the House of Rasasi. Like I said, this gives Hasavat a run for his money. Please like, share, subscribe. It don't cost you anything to subscribe. You know, I'm, I'm guilty of it, like I said, too. Anyway, I really enjoy this fragrance, and I know you will, too, if you like Hasavat. I know I'm a fan of Hasavat, and, uh, you know, this may be my first choice between the two from now on. Please like, share, subscribe. I appreciate you spending your time with me this morning, this Sunday morning. Uh, please have a good day, and I'll catch you next time.